We now welcome to the stage Lorne Wong. Hey everyone, since we're short on time, I'm just going to go at this really fast. Um, my name is Lauren Wong. I am a transfer student here at UCI, so like obviously I don't have a lot of friends here yet. And I would like, it's really hard to make friends in virtual settings. So I was trying to figure out like what's the one place where I can meet the most friends in college, like where are most college students going to be at? And then I realized, I don't know why it didn't hit me sooner, but automatically I got on Tinder. Because, like, I know everyone watching this, y'all are on there. I've probably seen some of you. Probably swipe left on a bunch of you, but yeah. Um, yeah, so I consider myself, not to brag, a pretty good Tinder user. And by that, I mean, like, I'm not a catfish. Like, in fact, the first thing I say to everybody whenever we match is cake or pizza. And, like, you guys are probably wondering, you're like, they would ask like, what do you mean? And I'm like, cause cake is what you're gonna get if I show up with makeup on and pizza is what I'm gonna look like without it. Um. And <laughs> that's just like my cute quirky way of saying I have bad skin. And so far, um, have not been getting any responses, but I think that is because of COVID. Like, you know what I mean? Like they're just being really um, safe and I respect that. <laughs> <laughs> was I getting responses before quarantine? No, but the fact is we are in quarantine now and that is definitely the reason why. So yeah, I know that's why. Um, so yeah, not doing very well in the boys department. On the other hand, I am making a lot of female friends. Yeah, so like, and you know what I noticed? It happened after I shaved my head, a lot of girls started being a lot nicer to me. Like they just come up to me and they've started DMing me like, <laughs> they're like what's your major um what are your plans this quarter uh do you listen to girl in red and i was like these questions are so random like what are these questions but um sure i'm like always open to new friends and i'm especially cool with having female friends because i am a feminist um shoot okay i would prove it but i think i left my feminist card with my antifa card somewhere so yeah i mean i guess another way i can prove it is i'll tell you guys something we've been talking about in our underground cult meetings um so like a lot of girls are trying to reclaim words like slut and hoe like yes i am a slut yes i am a hoe but um mm -hmm. obviously not everyone's gonna be comfortable with that so like I've come up with alternatives if you don't want to say things like I'm sexually active because that just sounds like weird, you know. So if you don't want to call yourself a slut, but you don't want to sound like you wear a vagina hat, I've come up with alternatives. So the first one is labia mohora. <laughs> so um, yeah, if you understand female genitalia, you'll understand that. But um, that one just doesn't work because it has the word whore in it and that's too close to slut in home. <laughs> Uh, the second one, this one's pretty good. It's not the best one, but this one's pretty good. Um, just say that you're actively post-virgin, you know what I mean? <laughs> like, you were a virgin, but not anymore, and like you're actively proving that time and time again, like you're very active there. But yeah, <laughs> the best one though, this last one I think is the best one, ladies, just say you have an outgoing vagina. <laughs> you know? oh my god like it's very sociable it likes to go out on the town meet a lot of new penises like it's just a very outgoing friendly vagina but um yeah and i think it's actually catching on because i don't know if you guys have heard that song it's by this group called uh city girls and it's like <laughs> this pussy talk english spanish and french this pussy talk euros dollars and yens and yeah so i was like y'all must have heard my joke or something like wow um and while i'm up here i'll be honest uh this pussy don't talk it's quiet it's quiet down there um my vagina has what people would call social anxiety but you know, it makes sense, you know what they say, like pussy like owner, you know? <laughs> so, um, yeah, it's just only comfortable with the few fingers it's known its entire life. Um, it's like oh in the God. talking stage with the toy right now. Uh, I'm kidding, guys, we've been in quarantine, they're way beyond the talking stage now. They're like married, a married couple now. But yeah, that's all I have for you guys today. Thanks for listening. And I hope you guys giggled at least. Woo!